The court coalition's formal complaint over the alleged involvement of senior government officials, including head of civil service Francis Kimemia in partisan campaigns, saw the IABC demand an explanation from Kimemia. In his defense, Kimemia denies any involvement in the activities or campaigns of any political party. In a letter to the IEBC, Kimemia terms the allegations made against him as baseless, malicious, horrific and a falsehood. The head of civil service denies traveling to Lake Elementaita or the Jacaranda Hotel for a meeting with the Jubilee flag bearer Uhuru Kenyatta and his running mate William Ruto on the 27th of January, as had been alleged by the Code Coalition. In the five-page response, Kimemia also denies attending a meeting at the Bombers of Kenya on the 29th of January to lobby provincial, county and district commissioners to support Uhuru Kenyatta or face the sack if Prime Minister Raila Odinga wins the election. Kimemia says he was at the Bombers of Kenya on the 28th of January for a district commissioner's conference that was officially opened by Internal Security Minister Kato Olemetito. Kimemia refutes all allegations leveled by the Code Coalition, giving details of meetings that he attended on the days he is said to have been engaging in campaigns, including a tour with President Mwai Kibaki to Othaya on the 9th of February, a day he is alleged to have met 68 elders over Uhuru's bid for the presidency. Kimemia, who says the allegations made against him are highly injurious to his career, now wants investigations carried out with the burden of proof on his accusers. He also wants the IEBC to clear his name and the names of other officers mentioned in bad light by the court coalition. Rita Tinina, KTN.